Hello everyone. So today's shave is gonna be the my choice for the underappreciated. Uh, so if you saw my Magnificent Eleven, you already know which one is. The Gissen and Forsthoff uh, three piece, the Zero Waste Timor. Um, today I'm, I'm I already loaded. We're gonna load it with the Kai because I never tried the Kai on this uh, razor. So. We're gonna try it today. I think the Kai is another blade you don't see there that often. I don't know if it's because it's very aggressive, but I do enjoy this blade a lot. Um, so that's another thing why I chose it is because I think it's uh, underappreciated as well. I don't know if it's underappreciated or if it's the price as well, which is a bit more expensive than the, the normal blades. Uh, so that's what I chose to go with. And underappreciated as well. I I think most of the sets from Master Mike, I barely see videos about them. Uh, I've actually been looking, and we rarely see people talking. Sometimes on Insta, it shows up from time to time, uh, but I, you don't see many reviews on them. So that's why I chose this uh, soap as well. I had other soaps that I could have chosen from them, but I asked my daughter and my wife which one they will would choose and uh, they chose this one, the Bee Owl. Uh, so that's the reason I chose um, Mastro Mike. Because uh, I think it's underappreciated as well. So I'm gonna do cold water again because it's been really really hot around these areas. So and I'll use the Mastro Mike uh, pre-shave soap as well. So which you don't see that often either. That's another one that you don't see that often. And I do enjoy it and it lasts ages. It looks like it's still new and I've been using it plenty of times. I don't think there's a week that I haven't used it lately. So, I don't know. I just find it uh, weird that there's not more people talking about it. Um, and it's not like it's not known, but um, I don't know. That's my choice anyway. I don't see it as often and I, I do enjoy it. He actually came out with two new soaps now. Is a, one is a stick that I can't recall what's the scent on it. Uh, and the last one, I think was last week that he came out with, is um, uh, Peach and Ice. I don't know if you guys know, but if you didn't know, I'm letting you know. So. Oh, so you're ready. Because it's cold water, I like to take a bit more time preparing to lift the hairs and all that. So that's it. Pre-shave is done. Let's wet the brush. We'll use Italian because Mastro Maker is Italian, so we use the Roma today. Synthetic knot. Just soak it there a bit. Bee Owl, it's kind of a pale brown, kind of. Um, so actually I'm gonna face leather. I normally don't like to put the brush, but uh, um, we'll do it anyway today. So let's blow it up. Yeah, very floral this scent. Actually, I have the, the scent notes there. Hold on. Let me just load it, pay attention to what I'm doing. I would say this is more than enough. So I'll just take the proto leather, which is plenty there, and I'll use it over the pre shave. You guys can see loads there already. Loads really quick. Just wash it. There we go. Washed. And now I'll, I'll just put it upside down to dry. There we go. Now, let's put the lid there so you guys can see. I'll just put it there. There we go. Me owl. Now, let's leather. Roma, synthetic knot. Very easy to leather this um, this soap. Uh, by the way, it's made in um, conjunction with um, 
TFS, that's it. Trying to remember now. It's the Chinese name Ching. I, I always forget the name. I have it there. Hold on. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Better to pick up another one. Uh, Chung Fung Sing. Jesus. <laughs> I always have difficulty pronouncing the. It's easier. TFS. Italian brand. So it's made in. With conjunction with them, so you know it's good quality as well. Yeah, and the scent note on it is very simple. It's Manoi floral and uh, talc. Uh, the talc I'm not completely sure, but some sites say that it's the blue fern. I have written there, blue fern talc, but uh, I'm not completely sure. But it's actually one of the most simple scents of Mastro Mickey that I have there. I do enjoy them all. They tend to, almost all of them, not all, but a majority of them tend to be a bit on the floral side, but always very manly as well, which is lovely. And I love the splashes as well, they last plenty of time. I'll just put a bit more water, small bit more water. Still very, still a bit dry. Nice, that's better. Small bit more. There we go. But it's lovely, a lovely, lovely, lovely scent. As I, and as I told you, this was chosen by my wife and my daughters my oldest daughters i have to say and it's funny that all of them chose this one i thought they were going to choose another one but no they chose this one which is actually the more simple of them all there we go oh, that's are ready i've been lathering for a while already, so let's go. Gissel and Forsthof Timor Zero Waste with a Kai blade, which is pretty aggressive. The Kai, pretty sharp, it's one of the sharpest in the market. Yeah, it's just lovely, lovely, lovely. I, I think this razor is just brilliant. Stainless steel handle. It's not too mild, it's not an aggressive one either, it's actually, I have to say, if I was giving this, if I was giving anyone a razor to start with, this would be one of them, for sure. I would ask first if they're very sensitive, because if they're very sensitive they have to get used to it first, so I would probably choose one that it's even milder just so that the skin would get used to it but if it's someone that doesn't have a skin that sensitive this is definitely one of the ones i would i would offer someone by the way i'm not sponsored by them or anything like that don't think i i bought this with my own money actually i got it on sale normal prices around 35 around that and I got it for 22 so really nice on a sale I, ju I just love this razor love this razor so easy so easy to grab so easy to shave with it so easy to control there's one small detail on this razor that for me is just above all all, all the others which is the way you load it there's a groove here on the top of the head that helps you grab the, bl the blade and then you just screw it on, you put it on and then when you're shaving it there's no overhanging. It's just brilliant. Small little detail that makes a huge, huge difference. Huge difference.
the only thing that I wish, but this is, this is kind of already being a bit picky, is the noise. I would love if you had just a small bit more of a noise feedback. But for this price point, stainless steel handle. You don't see that around. Made in Germany. This is not the old Timor. Guys, give me just a second. I'll be right back. I have to tell one of my daughters to put the music down. Give me just a second. We're back. Sorry about that, guys. It's just she just came in and she didn't know I was doing the video, so I just told her there. So she'll be waiting until we finish the video and then uh, she can put the music, blast the music as she likes it. Yeah, it's just, it's just so easy to, ra to shave with this razor, so easy, and this, this blade is just, goes through, through the stubble like butter, like melted butter. I wish you guys could feel the scent. We're back, sorry about that guys, the camera just shut down. I don't know what happened, uh, I think because it's so warm it's kind of uh, heating up and I had it charging. So I just took the charger now and let's see if uh, we can finish this video. So I did the first pass, I just uh, got ready for the second pass and that's when I found out that the, the camera had shut down. So let's go, I'm just gonna wet my face a bit more again. I still have soap there as you guys can see. So, just a small bit. Uh, this video is going great. <laughs> there we go. It happens from time to time, some accidents. But when you're shaving, you can go back, so let's keep going forward as we should. I was saying, I wish you guys could uh, be here just to feel the, um, the scent. The floral scent is just lovely and um, the soap is so creamy and mm, lovely I just love it I, I still find it that there's not that many people talking about this brand I don't know if it's because it's uh, made with TFS and it's very similar in terms of the feeling but the scents that's what makes the difference for me are just Brilliant, I have to say. There we go. I'll say we're ready for the second pass. There we go. So, second pass. Timor. Uh, Gissen, sorry, Gissen and first half um, with a kai blade. We go across. I'm just gonna keep checking from time to time, see if it doesn't turn off on me again. Well, it was probably because I had the charger on and it's so warm here, so it was probably heating too much and it just shut down. Hopefully, hopefully it was just that. So, I'm gonna go buff. There's so much slickness as well on this uh, on this soap. Sometimes like even like this looks like I still have loads there. So very, very slick. Actually, talking too much, thinking too little and I didn't, I would have have to go on the third pass if I didn't do this. Cause I always miss a few spots, do the mad face. Oh yeah, yeah, and you, you, you feel straight away that it's cutting there, so nice. Uh. Yeah. Now 
Nice. There we go. Now, the other side, cross. But I have to say, the video is giving me trouble, but the shave is not. It's actually being very enjoyable, I have to say. On the mad face. Go, go up, birds. And now we'll buff up. Try to do the two pass shave as I normally like. Yeah, it's so easy to control, guys. Right? So easy. And this snarling is just great. The other good thing about this scent as well is that you can use it in any, any time, winter, summer, whatever. Cross, no overhanging, so you don't have to worry as much. When you're doing this area. There we go. See, even in this area, I can go and buff upwards. Let's say, yeah, perfect. Nice. See if I don't miss any spots on my troublesome parts. There we go. I'll say we're done. I don't feel any a small bit there. There we go. Gone. I'll say we're done. I'm just gonna do the alum treatment now. Actually, I'm gonna show the alum treatment. Yeah. I'll just get ready for it. There we go. Now I'll just pet the face. Now, get my alum. It's the Omega stick. Alum stick. Now let's see the feedback. No feedback so far. Yeah, a small bit here, not much. That's it. Lovely. Wow. Yeah, small bit here. I always like to, where I have more feedback, I like to pass there a few more times until I don't feel it anymore. There we go. Hey, anyway, it's going away now. That's it. Pass it over water again. Cover it. Now, I let it dry, I'll wash all my stuff, and I'll see you back for the post shave. See you in a bit. We're back, my alum is still there, dried up, so I'm just gonna take it off and get ready for the rest of the post shave. There we go, we took the alum, now we'll just pat it back. There we go, leave a bit of moisture there, and we go to the post shave, be owl as well, just to combine with the soap. Scent is floral, manoi, monoi, with blue fern talc. Yeah, and it's a bit more intense. And I think it has menthol as well. I forgot to, to check. Yeah, it has a bit of menthol, so you feel the freshness there, which is lovely in a day 
up. Yeah, I still have a bit of feedback there on the bottom. It's lovely. Now on a warm day. I'm actually gonna put on my head as well. There we go. Smell a bit. Smelling great for the wife. <laughs> That's it, the owl has a bit of mental there guys, and you feel it now, freshness, so great stuff. This was an uh, eventful uh, video shave, um, but uh, I have to say lovely, BBS all over the place, perfect. So let's recap, the underrated, I chose the Kissen and Forst Hof, uh, Timur, Zero waste, three piece. Uh, I love this. Uh, I just love this razor. Th this razor for me has a small, uh, sm uh, small details here that just make her uh, special. One of them is this when you are loading and taking the blade, which I already took. It's there drying, but I'm, I don't know. I'm gonna take it off and see if I can show you. Might be better this way. I don't know if it shows there on camera, but you can see the groove there. And that just makes a huge difference when you're loading the blade. You just put the blade and then you hold it. You put it back on. Screw it with a stainless steel handle. And when you go to shave, there's no overhanging over there. It's just great, great. And stainless steel handle. So we use Kai blade, which I have there drying. There's nothing written there. Like all the guys, very simple blade but very very sharp. Uh, we use the Roma Synthetic Knot by Omega, the Mastro Mickey uh, pre shave uh, soap, and the Mastro Mickey set of the Bee Owl, which is very floral but very manly scent and I think is underrated with uh, the brand itself, Mastro Mickey. So that's it for me now. I hope you guys enjoy this eventful shave. And uh, I hope to see you in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to put a like it if you enjoyed it. And uh, as I said, I see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Ciao.